Hey, it's me, Andy from potatoesandpros.com, and in this video, I am gonna show you how I make roasted red pepper soup in the Instant Pot Ace Blender. So let's get into it right after this. To start, we're going to put in one medium onion and two cloves of garlic, everything chopped up, and get that sauteed. Next, we're gonna add in one jar or 16 ounces of roasted red peppers, drained, and if you want to chop them, you can. If you don't feel like it, you don't have to because the chopping is going to be done by the blender. To the pan, we're adding in a half a teaspoon of dried oregano. And we're also going to add in some salt and pepper to taste. Go ahead and turn off the heat to your pan and pour four cups of vegetable broth into your blender. Go ahead and add your pan sauteed items to the blender as well. Be careful, you don't want to get broth everywhere. So I try to use tongs as much as possible and then whatever little bit is left scoop into the blender. I'm using the Instant Pot Ace Blender because it cooks the soup that you make in there and it has a soup function. If you do not have a blender that also cooks the product, you can always just blend the soup and then heat it up on the stove. But you just press the button and it starts the blending process. I'll link my blender down in the description below if you're interested in this. I love this blender because of the cooking function. It just makes throwing together soup so much easier. 
Once the soup is cooked and blended, I like to add in one half cup of ricotta cheese and stir that in there. Optional, you can pour this into a pot on the stove and cook it more to get the ricotta cheese more incorporated in the soup, but you don't have to. It, perfectly fine and then you're all set you go ahead and pour it in a bowl I like to add another scoop of ricotta you can add some parsley on top do whatever you want this is just such a quick easy delicious soup I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to subscribe and like the video and if you like videos like this I make them here on my YouTube channel and I will have the recipe for this down in the description box and also on my blog. See y'all next time. Bye!